one man, one desire. A long time ago, in a land, in a time, coming this fall, they were young. Hold tight, they're back, he's back, they're all back. And this time, even funnier. And all the other movie trailer cliches. Just when you thought it was over, coming this fall, based on a true story. If you think you've seen it all, think again. Well, Sorry, John. That's shocking. <laughs> Are you here? Can you make something move or make a noise? Here. Nobody in here. One, two, three. That's room four. No, Why? I've got an arm. Oh, you've got an arm. Sit at the bottom of the stairs, you'll get them all night long. Yeah, but I've got a lot of be dust. No, no. I can tell dust. If you're here, could you let us know? Make a sound. Move something. Sounds like a male voice. There is no males here. Room two, it's two women. Two girls are in this room. We're the only males here. Right, okay. Everybody else is gone. Right, okay. That's not like that, sweetie. Oh, it's a gentleman that was talking there. Can you come and speak to me? What's happening over there? I don't know was a guy speaking. There was a guy speaking when Heather was talking. It's Heather's speaking. Yeah. Well, anybody here can you make your presence known? Can you show yourself? camera guy coming next week to have a look at the top floor camera. Mm -hmm. It's like I say, the last few weeks it went out, but that's it there on the blank spot. Right, then it's out there and it's it. And it's still censoring right, on so the box. Still, so the motion's still working, but the no, camera yeah. lens is not projecting a, an image down here. Yeah, that's... So what floor is it on the top floor? Top floor. It'd be interesting about where it went on, actually. Yeah, we'll leave that to the end. Yeah. It's, it's like I say, that's... What I'll be saying just now. Yeah. <coughs> no, no, that's where Evelyn and that's the end. Is that right? Um, it's like I said, that... I would expect something there mm -hmm. on that top floor. Yeah. I would expect something. I actually stayed in that room. Right, so you've experienced what that would be us yeah. experiencing. Um, because I took over the family room when I first moved in, because mm -hmm. the flat was empty. There was no furniture in it, so I stayed in the family room here. Okay. And my daughter was there, my brother was there, and my daughter wanted to get out of the family room. Okay. So I had to go out and buy beds, even though I've got beds, perfectly good beds at my house that I was bringing here. <laughs> I had to go out, go and buy beds so that we can move into the flat, because my daughter didn't want to stay there anymore. Right. Got you. The room that she said she picked up the bad presents when she was in that room. She was in there earlier, and the middle room is it's 
pretty heavy sometimes. Right, okay. Um, my daughter just refused to stay in it anymore. It's, she says every time she went to bed, it was just like somebody was in the room with him, mm -hmm. just looking. Yeah. No saying or doing anything, but just focusing on you. Yeah, just watching what you're doing. So it's yeah. curious. Yeah. But my daughter's no into this, so it freaked her. Freaked her out completely, yeah. She's and not the sort of person to speak <coughs> back. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. She just wanted out, out. Strange how it keeps on going off, eh? Yeah. Do the beeps ever change or do the same rotation all the time? Same all the time. Same all the time. T to me it's like, you know when you walk past the camera, mm -hmm. it's like somebody's walking up, and they're probably here. Yeah. And then a little while later, they're they moving back, back again. again. Yeah, so somebody's pacing back and forth. Yeah, somebody's like moving up and down on uh, yeah. that landing. Because, I mean, it's like I say, I come down at night sometimes because I hear noises here. Yeah. Uh, like I said, um, it was only about a week ago, there was a big loud crash down here. And I was upstairs, my daughter, Karen, and her man. You alright? <laughs> and there was a big loud crash, and I came down. Never even was okay. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to record this as I'm going through the building anyway, just in case. See, that's a camera there. Right. This one catches everything from here. And that's the female toilet. Oh, hi, babes. Straight across the, the toilets. Mm -hmm. um, I just want to come out. Can I get that bathroom light to go off? It just doesn't go off. I'm sliding still and it's really annoying. <laughs> Was well, it a motion sensor? Yeah. Could be picking up your body yeah, heat. I, I'm sitting there like as still as a thing and it's still going up. I'll, I'll I will say what I have experienced so far. Um, sat there in the chair, got it recorded. Did I can whether the camera picked up any, but you guys were making noise, so I, I hope I don't care if it picked up or not. What, well, about five or so minutes ago, I felt like you'd picked up on something, you'd said something earlier, like um, somebody was hearing someone in the distance. And that's what I was picking up on in my left ear. It felt like um, an echo from the beach, like someone was putting that... Um, like a seashell. Yeah, that's a, a shell to the ear. And it was like someone was trying to speak in the distance. You know if you're on the beach and you're hearing somebody in the distance. Well, like that's that. right. When yeah. she was in there, mm -hmm. she you thought she heard me, but it wasn't clear. Okay. And like you're saying, it could be like... Yeah, a beach like somebody's far away. An mm -hmm. echo sort of thing. Yeah. Uh, that that was that was interesting. And I thought, okay. And my my left ear's not even quite right since. It's like I feel like it's trying to tune in to listen to it, and nothing's happening. I'm speaking, shouting out, calling out. But that's interesting. I just can't get that light to go off. That's the only thing. So that's driving me insane. But I'm, I'm just want to see if there's another way we can switch off. I will try in a minute. I'll go off the power. Okay. I will be prepared for that. <laughs> Postcard in here. Yeah. So, is this what, what happens in here then? This is a very cold room. Yeah. Even with the heating on, I don't think it's on tonight, but even no. when it's on, this is extremely, extremely cold. Cold. Have you got? Yes, um, came and asked for a second coat. Right, because it's that cold. Yes, feel it's cold. Even when that's red hot. Yeah. The room just feels oppressive and you know, heavy. Temperature, yeah. yeah. This bathroom is tiny. Right. 
I'm going to switch it on because the fan will come on. Okay. It's a very small room, so it's just like a closet. Mm -hmm. That's alright. Yeah. I'll just sit here, lights off, and see if anything happens. Yeah. So I'm going next door to room one. Okay. I, I was going to check on the girls to make sure they're okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, go John. So I'll set that up there. Yeah. Right, we'll meet downstairs, I'll tell the girls to come down about 15 minutes. Down no problem. Ahead. Okay, Cox. Right, okay, guys. Hopefully, something happens here. A lot of EMF in this building. A lot. Is that it's not as bad up here as it was. There's a way to say that it's not as bad up here as it is down the stairs, but don't put volume down either. Just trying to find a happy spot. Too much electrics. I'm going to do my fire up PSB seven. Good evening, Spirit. Would you like to come forward and talk to me? Wish I had a company else now. Can't get a few cop off the map. Generally when you do stuff like this, just keep on chatting and whoever's here with you, I'll start speaking to you. It's really cold in here. Okay, I'll switch this off a minute. Switch it on, I have to turn the volume up and then put the scan on. Reverse, reverse up and good evening. Is there anybody here with me? I'd like to come and communicate. If you can, I've got a device here, you can talk to me on it. Can you tell me who you are? Saying something, but I'm not making it what you're saying. Can you come through a bit clearer for me? Come and talk to me. My name's Sean, by the way. It's a pleasure to meet you. Hi. Good evening. Good morning, sorry. Who are you? Give me different pictures. So it's speeding up and it's slowing down. I'm going to take it down for another notch. Come to 100 milliseconds. Um, so 150 milliseconds for saying that now. <coughs> Run in reverse. So you've got settings any better for you when you come to me and tell me who you are. As I said, my name is Sean. I am listening. Remember, communication is key. Same way you speak to a normal person on the street, in a public chat. Do exactly the same as what I'm doing now. 
Would you like to come forward and talk to the camera, talk to this device here and I'll be able to hear you? I think it's quite the name. What's your name? Can you come through tell me who you are? As I said, my name's Sean. What's yours? Tell me your name. I don't know who I'm talking to. Hey. Hey. I'm not just in here. Tell me your name. And will you tell me how many you are here? How many people's here? It's too hard to tell me your name. Tell me how many people's here. I'll tell you what I'm feeling at the moment, it's cold. I noticed that's the first thing I felt when I come into the room. Can you tell me your name please? Is that... I don't have to send a fact with Joe or not. Is it Joe? Is that your name? See, that, see that's a loud voice there. I'm just not making out what they're saying. This device I've got in front of me is a camera. And if you walk behind me or near me, and hopefully the camera should pick it up. I am recording in 4K. Not that you'll know that, but <laughs> I'm currently recording in 4K, so hopefully if something does come around me, it'll pick it up. Come and chat. Come sit down and chat with me. I mean, no harm. No harm at all. Come and chat to me. Film temperature changing just very slightly. Come, come, come in this area. Come and chat. Come to me then. No, 
know there's gas here, but I don't know if it, you would have picked that up because the PSP 7's running, but it was like someone coughed. level or or upstairs but I'm hearing somebody shaking. <coughs> I was trying to do a cough there so they say oh somebody's coughing. such an old building. This building um, dates back to the 1700s. It's a lot of flooring is really creaky and I like it when it's like that. Especially if there's no one. I don't know if that's people speaking or not. I'm hearing somebody. But they're saying that it's good that you're in an old building because everything creaks and everything starts moving, walking about. You'll, you'll start hearing that. I'm definitely hearing somebody there. I'm trying to send forward this time. I'm going to speed up a bit. Hello? Can you hear me? Can you hear me? device set up in the bed here and um, hopefully these guys can see it hopefully could you come come stand beside me here maybe set the meter up and set the side of the bed I'm not actually feeling like there's a, a 
pressing so somebody here if I'm not a noise or I don't know if that's why everybody else walking around. You know what it's like yourself guys when you're doing investigations or everybody's walking about chatting to you and that. Very interesting with the the male down the stairs at the bar that I went with. Uh, the one that was telling us about what he's experienced being here, you know, working in an environment living in living in the building so let's hope that something else happens. Sounds like they're moving about. We're going to do it in 15 minute segments. So somebody's been here then, I go away, sit somewhere else for 15 minutes. Very quiet at the moment. It happens when you're doing investigations. And I'm just hoping by me communicating with you guys, the viewers, that hopefully somebody else will come in and say, No, it's not. <laughs> we always hope for that, that, that one voice, that one voice counts out of any investigation. It can be here for hours and hours and just that one voice counts. I actually miss doing this guys. It's been nearly four years since we've been out and done something like this, so I'm really enjoying it. I'll try one last time with the PSP7 and then I'll move on to another area and see what goes on. some reason the PSP wasn't picking up any audio. No it is. I don't know that. Okay, I'm gonna be here for another few minutes. So try and tell me your name please. Just before I go. Just so I know how to try to speak up. Oi. Good evening, sir. Oi. Oi, oh, again. That's twice. Oi, oi. You got my attention. Come on. Who are you? What's your name? Speaking to stop it. Manipulate the frequency so can hear Don't wake up. Tell me you say, don't wake up. What do you mean by don't wake up? You didn't wake up. Did you fall asleep and then you didn't wake up? What are you trying to tell me? No. What happened to you? What do you mean by don't wake up? Hello. What's the response to it? When you're speaking, something comes through. Sorry, you're going to have to say that again. I was talking at the same time as you. Guys, remember, if you hear anything, put a, put a note in the comments if you can hear anything that I can't hear, okay? So did you not wake up? Is that what you're trying to tell me, sir? So, 
You know what I'm talking about? Can you tell me who, your name, who you are? Or what year it is, where you are? I know this is a very old problem. You tell me, you tell me what year it is. There's a breath. That was an actual breath there, like... <gasps> Just with this bump, what a... Are you breathing there? Are you trying to scare me? It takes a lot to scare me. I speak to a lot of dead people. I just like to hear your stories. What was like back? Where you were? What did you do? What did you do in this hotel? Tell me, please. If you're never going to talk to me, I'm just going to leave. Would you like to come somewhere else with me in the hotel? Would you like to follow me? To say yes or no? Build up your energy, yes or no? Would you like me to continue to speak to you throughout the night? I need some walk. Sounds a little almost robotic. Would you like to come with me so we can keep on communicating? Yes or no, please? I'll tell you what I was experiencing there, I feel like I was, I was being sick a little bit, but obviously I'm not. I, I, want, I feel like I want to be sick. Is that what you're making me feel? Did you, you said that you didn't wake up. Did you choke on your vomit?
I heard something but I'm not quite making out what they're saying. Okay, I'm going to leave now, okay? I'm going to regroup with everybody else. I'm going to regroup with everybody else. I'd like to say thank you for coming through and talking. That's only somebody right there behind me. Is there anything you'd like to say before I leave? Are you, saying, are you saying hope you continue to speak? Is it a delay? Are you hearing my questions? Okay, I'm going to switch the device off now. Thank you for communicating. And hopefully you can communicate throughout the night. Goodbye. I'm coming back. Yeah, I'm coming back. That was definitely a good reply of coming back. I'll definitely be coming. I'm hearing you. Why is it every time you've got to switch the bit? Why is it every time you go to switch the device off that try to communicate there? But when I've had it long enough, I know they would have any intelligent responses. So we've got no names, no year. Hopefully we'll get the rest of that throughout the night. Mike. A Joe and a Mike. Is that correct? Sean, you might what? You might end. Oh, just back my tongue. Did you just say Sean, you might end? Is that what you're saying? Sean, you might end. Are you telling me right to the end? I'm kind of confused what they're trying to say to me now. People get a strange noise as well. Are you saying Sean go right to the end? Up. Right to the end. Up. Is that what you're saying? Okay, I'm going to come back. I'll come back from another room and talk to you from there, okay? Mm. 
very interesting so picking up on but it sounds to me like a Joe and Mike, you guys might hear it a lot differently and it's not until you go back and listen to your recordings you hear things completely different to when you're actually in the room when you're operating it I don't know if I'm saying if it's Sean right to the end or Sean go right to the end sound like somebody's saying going up now we are on the first floor there is another floor above here interesting if anybody can hear anything put something down below in the comments Still hearing voices, I'm presuming everybody's walking about having a chat. It's, it's interesting, it's intriguing. I'm, I'm really enjoying this. It's, I've got a really good feeling about this one. Let's go to another room. Yeah, so I'm going to let you have a, a look in here before I leave. That's the, the chair area I was sitting in there. Uh, I've had the Ghost Meter Pro sitting here sent upright. I'm trying to get the gyroscope because as soon as you turn it on its side right, there's a lot of EMF in here so I thought if I put the gyroscope very slightly up the way anything interacts with it will, will move it. Um, I have had the camera pointing here towards the shower area. But really nice, good feeling here. I like this I like this picture. It's like a couple who are in love and uh, they're walking down the high street. I like it. Right. So let's go down the stairs, I'll switch, pardon me, I'll switch that off, PSB7, I need to be really quiet at this stage, but we do have guests here so I have to be really quiet. Right, so no cameras on. Let's make sure. See that stain on. That has moved, but it could be me. It could be me at setting off. So as times went on, it's been opened up, so it's yeah. more spacious. Through there, there was a door that went that way, which was like a little office area. It was just like a little office area to the right, and to the left was the entrance to go through there. Through into there. Cool. So, it has changed over the years. Yeah. Also, at some point, this was open. Right. This section here was open before they built that barn. Right. So since the barn's been built, like they partitioned that off. These steps originally went right across. Okay. And they stepped So they like didn't like a dan the dance play area like they were yeah. advertising in that yeah. picture you showed us. And then they built this bar in there mm -hmm. to house that side for the restaurant cool. and make that area there. Yeah. So it has changed. Yeah. And the disabled toilet was another office as well. Right opposite here was okay. the disabled toilet, which is now, but that was an office area as well. That used to be the main reception as you came in. You went there, went to your room, and went to the room. Went to your room upstairs. Now it's all done from behind the bar. Yeah. So. Cool. Get a wee bit of history there. You want to read Any other cans? Cans of coke? Cans of iron brew? 
I keep on thinking there's a step here. There's no. no there's no I thought that as well. Uh, as well did you feel that as soon as you got this bit? Like there's a step, but there's no <laughs> step. Yeah. That's strange. That how we both were picked up on that. <coughs> That's an our entrance. Hey, Yeah. I'll leave it to me, eh? Yeah, of course I'll. <laughs> no, it's fine. I need to get, I need to get the, the vet levelling. I'll move that just, just out of the way a wee bit. Right, so camera down. It's about there. Echo? Echo? I used to walk there. Echo? You ready? Because I'm saying who's there. Good morning. Somebody's saying echo. Yeah. 
That was just in three. That's what I was on the PSP seven. What was the woman's name that was killed here? How did she die? Here. <coughs> Where did you find the murder weapon? Something table. Sorry. Table. Table. Just want him right here. In the roof space, well, in the cellar roof space, just there. It was found. Okay. But it wasn't found for probably 70, 80 years. It was in that space. It's been hidden. It's been hidden in the space. Only when they come to do the new typing and things, the roof and it fell out. Why are you here? Why are you here? Did you go home back to the spirit world or did you stay on the air? Three. 
in there's three other spirits in this hotel. Do you know who they are? And the male or female? Clear male voice there. Yeah, very. Don't know what he said though. Yeah, he said something, but I, I didn't catch it. Do you know came my over, name? Came over the top of everything there. Yeah. 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 Spoke. What's her name? Have. I heard that clear as day. Have. Oh, somebody else is speaking when I'm speaking. Yeah. Better shut up. What's this man's name? Mike, I picked up a name Mike and Joe up the stairs as well. Oh, I did say Mike. Room three. Mm -hmm. 
It was like, it was a like stop. Stop. Who's telling somebody to stop? Talk to me or tell me anything. I just something. I had that yeah, in. I just I didn't catch it. No, I didn't catch that. That was quite Scottish tone as well. William. Somebody just say shut up. Yeah. Like uh, it was like shut up and laughing after that. Yeah. It's like shut up, listen to what I'm trying to tell you. It's hard. <laughs> I'm happy to talk to you. That's where the eats now, right? We have the egg. I can hear you too. Come on, keep on speaking to her. Keep on trying to speak to the device so we can hear it clearer. Shout if you need to. Make your presence known in the room if you need to. 
Yeah. 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 Murdered her here. Somebody said, somebody said, somebody said, fucking hell. Eh? Somebody said, fucking hell, that was death, man. Yeah, that. Is the person here that murdered the woman? No. why they called it the living room because that's in the dead room and people would parade to see the open casket mm -hmm. and then the casket would be removed after yeah. a lot of times caskets remained overnight and collected in the morning yeah yeah the gentleman that died in the was your body found What's the name of this hotel? Chance you knew Evelyn was coming tonight. Sense of humor, I like it. Are you glad you're here? Yeah. 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 Did you like my jokes earlier? Yeah. 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 Yeah.
the day that the mimic cure. Do you want to get it I told you something. <laughs> it's like it's like they're trying to say to you, I've already told you, but we've not heard that. Yeah, we're not hearing you correctly. Can you try and say it again to us? I know it sounds like we're being going on and on and on, but can you try and come through a bit clearer for us, please? Speak, speak over here. We'll hear you. Mike. Mike again. Mike and Joe. This name is picked up up on the stairs. Mike, what room were we speaking to you in? What was the number? Peter. What number were we talking in when I had the radio device in my hand? Dead what? Who's dead? Yeah, can you come forward? Yeah. 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 Yeah
John leaving the room now. What room's John going to? Unless they're trying to tell you the person is deaf. Yeah. 
yeah. knows in death is in death, but hearing is in death. Has anyone got any messages for anyone here? Yeah. Afraid. Afraid. Who's afraid? Oh, did you hear somebody saying definitely when yeah. I said afraid? Oh, goosebumps there. Who's afraid? He said sitting again. I'm going to sit, stand at the bar. Do you want Sean to sit down? Yes. Who's afraid? Who's you want me? You want me? Yeah. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Keep sitting. Yeah, you'll get to sit down. Come and give me information, then I'll sit down. Tell Sean something about him that maybe none of us in the room will know. No. <laughs> He's secretly gay. <laughs> <laughs> no, <I> like it. <laughs> Sounded like they said like it. You said they said Anna. Yeah. What if it's not an Anna that's meant to be good? What if it's someone to get rid of? There was, it sounded like. There was one. Yeah. That's where there was someone. Did I say, did 
joy. <laughs> you said feeling problems in a bit. I can do my feeling like this. Is it joy? Yep. You got feeling problems, joy. <laughs> He's watching his camera screen, oh, seeing everything coming. He's like, What's up? That's the sort of stuff. It's all movement behind the bar, that's what I went here. And next thing I see, the movement there, and we can able to open up to it. Well, it's good to be a silly jump scare, isn't it? That's movement towards me, so.
Nee, das ist er. Sie gehen mit sich.
fight and let the girls know that you're here. Touch one of them. Say hello. You're not making any sense. So why did you want us to come up to room seven? <laughs> We're all sitting, all sitting. We're listening, we're listening. Why do you want us here? I'm going 
conversation uh, between uh, yourselves. Uh, have a conversation uh, with uh, us.
next room unless you want to tell us something. So is it like spider webs? No, no. It's no. like a tightness, sort of yeah. like a presence of someone's dry So like pressure. You know when your skin feels really dry? Yeah. And you like eat something that stretches the skin that kind of hurts and it's like that? Yeah. yeah. When you're, you're, you've got dry skin. Was that when you were doing that room, number five? Your yeah. Mom, your mum asked somebody to come down and play with you. But Ed, right, well that makes sense. So it could be them trying to... We started smelling. Ed, started smelling the smoke and that, the shiver. I stood and I thought, I'm going to stand the shiver. I moved the shower curtain once and I just got my thing. I didn't see it, no hunt, but I, I smelled it like a big one. But when Kerry yeah. was in there originally, she didn't smell she, she it. Didn't and I didn't smell it, it mm -hmm. but we no. went in a shower and we could smell mm -hmm. it. <coughs> you had to close the curtain though. Yeah, <laughs> that was the only way to do it. And I think that could just be the curtain. And Somebody smoked in there the and the curtain was singing. Because so then if, if it was washed and I did it again, that's the only way it would be yeah. to turn on. Right, okay. But yeah. Keep skeptic. Yeah. Keep skeptic. Oh, yes. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I don't have a great 
The Sunday turns to Robert. Last night. Oh, last night. Last night. Last night. Last night. Last night. John, when you said that the woman was shot, do you know if she was shot in the head? I don't know where she was shot. It's never, nobody's ever said. All we know is she was shot up here and the gun was retrieved. Downstairs. Downstairs in the cellar. Right. What room was she in? Was this one the one next door or the one at the end? This room. This room. But, um, I, I can't tell uh, or I can't see whether it was this or next door or the end room. I can't tell which exactly room <laughs> did occur. Because it was all on the same one at one time. Yeah, th this was all like one floor in here. Right, right. Good. Good. I thought that was true. I thought it was true. Okay. Mm. What was the woman's name that was shot in this room? Tell us who it was that hurt her. 
It is a person who thought the woman still here. person that shot the woman's in this room. Probably. Or do you not know who shot the woman? the woman's name that was shot. What's her name Ben? Get out. Do you hear Get out. Yeah. That was clear as day. The person telling us to get out was he, that the person that shot the woman. Who is it that shot the woman? What's the person's name? Sounds like you said don't have time. So then we'll have to ask that question again. I'm not hearing you clearly. Who was it? That hurt the woman. Yeah. We're not running anywhere. Unfortunately, I've got that urgent feeling to know it's that I'm picked it. I'm okay. We're staying. Please, can you tell us the name? Did he tell her to run? Want to again. Making any sense? I'm sorry, we're not asking you, can you be a bit clear? <laughs> run and like no saying who it is and they won't say who shot her either. Yeah. Not me. Was there more than one person involved? asking but it's so hard to decipher what was the gentleman's name or names of the people that hurt the lady in this room Mm -hmm. 
It's like it happened and nobody wants to say anything about it. Yeah. Who the woman was or who actually done it. How many people were a part of the murder? Four. Seems to be a woman talking and then. And she's the trying mood. to speak. Yeah, she's like, speaking over her. Yeah. Mm. Feel bad. You feel bad for her, Martha, than that? Sound like a practical joker more than anything else. Before I go, can you tell me the woman's name, please? Was it a woman that killed this other woman? Now, so we're going to be going soon. I mean, you can give us the woman's name, but we'll probably find out anyway. Could be one of several names. A husband. This is why I think a woman may have killed the woman uh, over a man. Right, okay. It's a possibility it? that was there. Uh, yeah. yeah. So, you, you are talking more than one person involved, because yeah. a woman and the man. Well, yeah, what if it was a married woman and him having an affair? <clears throat> So then it would be two married couples. So it's a that possibility that a previous owner here was involved because with a gun found in the cellar, yeah. either the owner was part of or asked oh, to, to get rid of the gun. Yeah. What about this owner's wife? That, that's 
Yeah. It wouldn't have been the previous one that was just here, it had been back. Did you say that it's like eight years of a difference between yeah. what five? Yeah. Mm. Is there only one or two in between that time? Probably about three. Three people actually had the place in the time span of when the murder happened and when the gun was found. Is the woman's name is Queen Bethany? There have been a lot of people involved in what happened and nobody wanted to say anything. Well, that's true. And that's why they're, they're, they're literally explaining that, but they're within a kind of circumstances, so they're just trying to be yeah, as helpful who, as they can. But, yeah, exactly. Who actually pulled the trigger of the gun, maybe? Well, like me, a gunshot wouldn't be quiet. No. And back then, they didn't hear silences. So exactly. Or a pillow. Or a pillow, yeah. yeah. But then, if you're in a struggle with situations, yeah. there's no pillow involved in that. Unless you're, she was subdued yeah. or knocked out before the Well, apparently, when she was shot, several people heard the vibration of it. Yeah. So there would have been a lot of people here yeah. at the time. Yeah. So. How many people so there's a lot of re recounting stories. There have been a lot of people in here, so mm -hmm. half of these people might still be roaming around here yeah. with part of the story. Mm -hmm. So the names coming forward, there's probably people that, bit right people that are here yeah. at the time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm not particularly feeling anything in this room, but since we've came in, I keep my attention keeps being drawn to the corridor bit. Yeah. 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 Just this bit. Same here. I think um, I came with this when we sat here. And well. it did feel like that there was somebody <coughs> hovering about just in that corridor bit. See where you are, that used to be a kitchen area. You right, know, along yeah. that wall. And then this this wall was put into play here. Mm -hmm. Um and it was set not like turning out the left but a a straighter line, yeah, and the rooms were left <coughs> and right to that right. as you go through. So, sort of from the doorway beyond towards the bed mm. was the walkway down that way, right? And we could just hear that thud, mm. yeah. I put my, my thing. Oh, was that you? Yeah, the lid pops and closes. That's it, like no, no, it was a bang from uh, yeah. lower levels, yeah. I keep checking the camera because I've heard it a few times. Mm -hmm. and there's no movement yeah. down there. No, I was just saying, like, initially I wasn't sure if it was a male or a female, but the longer we've sat here, I feel that it's more of a female energy that's sort of hovering about, <coughs> just in that area there. That feeling has been lifted an awful lot. Yeah, I... I it, when I came in, I was fine, and then it got really heavy, and then it left again. Yeah, because I was cold for a bit, and now I've warmed up. Mm -hmm. And because like warmed up, it's not as cold when yeah. we came in the room. <coughs> <coughs> the temperatures you, come you're up. You're actually freezing in that other room. Yeah, but the, that's the one then. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but this room, there's no heating on in here. No, there's, there's nothing. No. 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 No heating on in here. Oh, and then again, being hot, 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 hot. And then if you're on the top floor, yeah, but other rooms are freezing, right. so like ice cold, right? Wrong one. <laughs> <laughs> and we're back in the room. <laughs> Trying to dim it through the snow. Oh, yeah. So it's like I say, after three o'clock, that's when that the is on. The heat is on. Is that one yeah, on? Yeah, it's roasting. Should be on. Yeah. <clears throat> Mind you, when I come in here, I was sitting here all the time, and I was freezing cold sitting here. Yeah. And I've only recently just started to warm up, mm -hmm. but I was freezing yeah. when I was sitting here, like my legs. Do we all want to go for a coffee? Yeah. yeah.